Hi folks, how are you doing? My name is Delafix and we are going to continue with X4 today. So there are th two things I want to achieve today and that is um, getting continuing or actually continue with the uh, mission uh, towards distant shores which does require a bit of, uh, of flying so I do hope you... Uh, are able to bear with me and also i'm sorry that i'm moving my chair so much also i want to redesign this base the whole part base um we'll do that by just achieving wealth <laughs> let's get some money in here uh let's get that components 500 i usually leave half a million so yeah let's get that all started don't need to put in money over there. Oh, look at that. The silicon carbide factory. Absolutely making us a buttload of cash. So, we got 6.9 million. And I want to get started by increasing the hull part factory over here to a 4. 4x4. Uh, four four. We'll pay the money and... I do... A lot of overkilling with my bases i know this i'm sorry and let us try to design something that kind of looks cool uh, while still being very functional so let's get started on that let's confirm changes now i've already checked and the best place to put in an area for large ships would be over here now I'll say it right now. Yes, in the future, I will probably change all of this. That's why I'm most likely thinking about changing this entire air, uh, idea. We would, actually I would, like to make sure that we get the Terran stuff over here as well. And in order to do this, we do need a foundation. And the foundation is what we are going to get started on right now. Let's get a cross section. This is completely... Why do I always get the wrong one? We need this one. And we can build on top of it as well. Currently, we'll just do it like this. <coughs> Let's get the container one just below the system. Or just build yeah let's do it like this because we can actually build upwards and downwards i want to have two containers and we just where well, is it uh, just a bit like this let's go liquid to the side and we'll do the same thing with solid let's go to production and let's get solar solar and can I place them down here to the sides? I kind of want to do it differently. Let's go to docking modules and let's get the standard mediums with the three slots and three medium slots and the one or six small slots. Because I kind of do think I would like to get a lot of ships in the near foreseen future. So we'll just do, is one enough? No, I don't think so. Let's just copy this sequence. And do like this. Now, I believe we can now fit in, yeah, solar panels without them touching each other. I hate when that happens. And... This will need to get building. Let's not go with high preset. Let's go to low. Let's start these changes. We still have the uh, constructor over there. Now, um, we need graphene. We need refined. And we need hull parts, right? Yes. We can use the hull parts over here. And let's flip you around. Now, I know that this is going to be a absolutely 
massive amount of time me flying and I will try my utmost best to make it enjoyable for you to watch but we all know X4 has a lot of downtime you don't even want to know how large these saves actually are because I think I've just invested a good hundred hours already in this save file let's just flip you we just click you could we just get you dude seriously <laughs> sometimes I wish they would listen um, it is not hitting But it's completely blocking... The, ah, that doesn't really matter. Eventually, we'll change these into the Terran ones. At least, that is what, what I would like to do. You, copy sequence. Actually, copy module. And we'll place you down there as well. So, we've got two refined metals. And one hull pot factory. Place you down over there. Copy module. Flip you around. And even it out. I think this would be enough for now. We have a lot of room to expand. Oh, that's going to be nice. Let's confirm all of these changes. Let's close the menu. Let's go towards our factory. And... Apparently, it's not going in yet, so for now, let's just completely, oh, well, we'll just place in some money, who cares, right? So, for our mission, which we are going to be flying quite a bit, in, is uh, we need to go ahead and fly all over here. Once we are there, it's going to be a few jumps, and, and this one actually is going to be rather tricky. Set guidance over there, and let's go autopilot. autopilot. Engaged. Oh, this game absolutely looks amazing. Absolutely looks so good. But oh my, oh oh my. How I wish my cedar would interact with the traveling mode. I really would have liked that. So we got the medium ship over here. Which, well, we're currently not going to use. So many things we want to do. We need to... Entering maybe we can exchange for save up. Start to very minimal, uh, uh, minimum versions of these stations. Like, and... We'll have to supply them. We will have to supply them. Oh, it's going to be a logistical nightmare. Maybe we should just leave it for when we start expanding with the Terrans. Now, of course, I would like to go into missions like the Terran versus Xenon. Absolutely sounds amazing. Because I think it's the, the majority of fighting will happen in there. And I'm not very familiar with... Oh my god, what is happening? With how the fighting actually goes, because I've seen people, one of them is a buddy of mine, Wenek, who is Entering system absolutely enjoying boarding. And that boarding can be quite fun and actually entertaining to watch. And I'm very aware that we have been doing a lot of building, but that is how I think. I like to play this game. Entering system. Silent so once we are here, and it's just one more jump, we'll probably get cloaked. And from that point on, I'm just hoping we don't get destroyed. So let's go ahead and let's fly. And oh, cross your fingers, guys, because here we go. Cover activate. Oh, Entering dear, here we system. go. I take fast choice. Oh, please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. I don't like this at all. Okay. Other pilot not really working for me. Come on. 
Don't kill me, please. Oh, wow. Okay, so what I've been told so far is I need to go over in this range. So let's go for it. I will try to squeeze in a mission every now and then. Until we actually get the economical stuff out of the way, we are building massive fleets and just, I don't know, raining down the hammer on the Xenon or perhaps anyone else. Autopilot. And autopilot. Disen unknown zone. Okay, let's take a look. Is there anything in here? Um, could be over here in this angle though. Let's go over there. Let's take a look because usually gates... You will find gates. You will see gates. Let's not do the autopilot. Let's just um, go travel mode. Have a bit of fun ourselves. We see some stations over there. Can we see a gate? Hmm. So far I would say no. Of course, we can also use our scanner. Which probably would have been the best option. Considering it does cover quite a bit of the map. Let's take a look. Well, apparently I'm a complete goof and I didn't see any of it. So there's still Aragon or Argon. Oh, maybe I should use... No, I think I do need to be in here. Evox choice and let's see if we can find a Xenon base. Let's uh, deactivate this and move you into that direction. Can I see anything? Eighty kilometers. Let's go to scanning mode again. There is an unknown station over there. Ooh, this is so awkward that the map completely misaligns why does it do that unknown station maybe i should pick this one i feel like i need a different gate I know that we need to go through this territory, so maybe, just maybe, I'm in the wrong area. Yeah, let's go back. Autopilot let's go back and engaged. we'll search for it some more. Super highway, a take fast choice. Yeah, we'll One. just fly ourselves because the computer is doing some weird stuff again. So, if, are you playing this game as well and just watching the series, just sitting back? Because if you haven't, go pick this game up. The game is amazing. It truly is such a lovely game because there's so much to do. That is definitely not how you should go through this. And we'll slowly drift through this. Come on. You got to be kidding me. I am absolutely a damn pro at missing gates. I'll, I'll promise you that. Oh, never mind. We've managed. Entering. I take fast choice. There is a gate. One. There is. A, wait, I think we need that gate. There is a gate for us. Quite nearby. Yeah, let's go towards it. Cover active. Ooh, Might there's well a cover. 
Danger. Hazard entering system. Oh yeah, definitely. Arcus, I... Ooh, that... Ooh, no, 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 no. Please give me back. Cover deactivated. Let's go. Now, the cover deactivation is going to be rather annoying. There's another gate. Let's go there. What's this? There's two gates over here. Oh man, my shields. Cover activated. Yaki. Unknown object. Ooh. Hey, I think I know where we are. I'm pretty sure those star patterns match the ones from the pre-shutdown gate maps. This is the way to the old Federation. Oh? The old Federation? Okay, funny. Danger. Interesting. I don't think Hazardous I need those. So, there's probably more gates. And I would like to go over towards this angle and just take a look. We'll definitely explore other systems. Definitely in the future, but let's try to at least find the Yaki base. Cover deactivated. Super highway, unknown sector. Yeah, I don't need that. Okay, can we find... Oh, there is a super highway. Interesting. Maybe we should take this. Yeah, let's try it. Let's go set over there. And let's go. It is interesting to seeing all of these. Because they, they're just defensive bases. How many defensive bases Cover do we need? Activated. Yaki. Danger. Hazardous region detected. Okay, let's go through this one without failing this time. Here we go. Okay, where will it bring us? Entering Arcus Cascade. Okay, let's just 17. fly somewhere in the um, twelve o'clockish period. Do we see anything else? We can do scanning mode. Oh wait a minute! There you go. There is another portal. Let's head over there. Now, there's one thing. You can see that everything now is red. We are now unable to do anything with our own systems, our own bases at all. Which I find is somewhat awkward. Because they are still mine. Whether or not I am flying in a yaki cloak or just in my regular ship. It is uh, somewhat, I think, very awkward. What is this? That is so cool. Oh dear. Oh. Oh. Entering system matrix number seven nine B. Xenon station. Damn, these are cool. Really cool. Okay, let's go to long range scanning again. station over there. Let's just go somewhere over here then. Interesting. These are former they're all destroyed. Unknown zone. Interesting. That is so cool. Unknown ship. Unknown ship. Oh there's a gate. There's one. There's one. Let's go. This is really cool. Never mind. Wait a minute. Go here. Stop. Deactivated. Look at this. This is so cool. Unknown ship. Massive ships. Just strange rock formations. I really like. I really like that. Activated. Okay, where Yankee. are we? I'll just follow some of these uh, stations. I definitely want to explore these. Definitely with this ship. This 
really opens up the Cover game. So, there's one thing that I've tested. I don't know if you tried the same, but Yaki. you cannot assign a pilot to this uh, ship. You will have to fly it by yourself. Entering system. Okay, what the hell Savage. is this? It worked! Great oh? magenta flight spirit of cybernetic science, it worked! Haha! <laughs> I can barely contain my excitement! Okay, 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 let's, uh, I think we found it so far, which is nice. We've actually went all the way to get so soon? Or well, actually close. Oh. We were over here. What is this? A Xenon station? I think we might have already passed one of these earlier. I must say, I am rightly flabbergasted by his intricate entanglement. And such an aggressive color scheme. Oh, no sightseeing. Okay, never mind then. No sightseeing apparently. This is no fun. <laughs> Forcing me to not go sightseeing. How mean can you be? Okay, so we'll uh, we'll head over towards this base over here. Which is looking relatively normal to me. Out of docking range. Docking granted. Okay, we're going from the uh, the back end then. Well, let's see what they want. Oh, there's trader. Oh, that is nice. This way you can trade. Ooh, really like that. Up. Okay, well, at least we are uh, done. Let's get up. Oh, glad you're reasonable, stranger. I'm adding you to the admission list for my office. That does sound eerily familiar. I think I will terminate my communications for now. Where's the rest of your face? No, no, don't you run away from me. <laughs> okay, whatever. Um, let's go. It would be interesting to try to get a positive relationship with all of the factions and then destroy them. Finally, come in. Okay, you, you're one of those as well. Okay, well. You got some weird ass face as well. Well, okay, let's go. Well, where do I start? Where would you start if you were in my place? You suddenly barge into our system in a ship that obviously doesn't belong to you. You're a damn security risk! Okay, so if I'm a damn security risk, then why am I alive? Because you're not the first to arrive here. Ever since the realignment of the gates, we're picking up scrappers, adventurers, scientists. Maniacs! All of you! But we can't let anyone die out here. There are already far too few of us. Then... Why keep me alive? Uh, because you're not the first to arrive here. Oh. Ever since the realignment. Okay, we have already got this one. I'm sorry for that. We are um, up scrappers, adventurers, scientists. I was kind of hoping that the options would go away if you actually see them, but uh, apparently not. It just continues. So. We can't let could you stop talking, uh, Candy, please? Far too few of us. Organic. Organic, but organic. So, are you trying to recruit me? I'm not asking you to 
join the Yaki. We all have our allegiances. But I am asking you to have a closer look. Make your rounds, see how we live. Might just change your perspective. Okay, so what is this place? Oh, have I not made my formal speech yet? Welcome to the home of the Yaki. Freedom loving, freebooting and uh, who am I kidding? What you see here is the last remnant of the Yaki, at least the last that we know of. When those gates shut down, two generations ago, my people got stranded here, together with the Xenon. Most died in that first week. A few found hiding spots inside an abandoned outpost. And then, some stars and augmentation artists found the solution. I almost feel sorry for these guys. These things on my face, they're not just for show, you know? I don't exactly know how they function, but they keep the scene on the way, most of the time. But that's not all. This off art also lets a few of the most gifted Yaki do things to the Xenon, brought them here and there. It doesn't always work, and you've seen what happens when you indulge too much, but it kept us alive. And so here we are, pirates to some, abominations to others, and with the Xenon strapped to our back like a damn tumor. Doesn't matter if we stay or leave. Either way, we're fair game. Okay. Um, let's say Obelisk was killed in a fight. Good, then he's no longer a threat. Don't get me wrong, it's kind of sad that he's gone. He was a good Yaki once. But the way he plastered himself with those cybernetics, with no regard for his or our safety? There's really only one way this could have ended. Okay, so are you letting me leave? Damn right I am. Thanks to that fool obelisk, the war is already underway. With you on the loose, there'll at least be one more pilot with a brain. And a conscience, I hope. Another thing, I called you a stranger earlier, and that was a lie. There's someone I'd like you to meet. Hey. Eh? <laughs> okay, he's the Borg. No, he is our co pilot. Interesting. So, um,. Guys, I think this is actually a perfect timing just to um, to end up the video. There's been a lot of flying, a lot of hello. talking, and um, hello. Uh, let us continue with even more talking in the next episode. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Have a good one. Bye-bye.